touch that because it will shock you. Come on in. Oh boy, make me feel like an iguana. Oh. Okay, so I don't really hold cameras steady, guys. So like, you know, don't feel offended. <laughs> Out for Judd, so he knows <gasps> the scary object is in. Anything? Nah, he doesn't care. Hey, we'll find out. <laughs> Okay, remember guys how I told you about teaching your horse to bring their head down? See, he's already trying to hug me because he knows this is coming in. He's helping. Now his head's up high, so I'm just going to ask for the head down. Head down. And we got him. Teach your horses the head down cue. It will help you. Especially if you're short. <laughs> Okay, let's walk him over to the tarp, shall we? So are you calling me short? <laughs> <laughs> You're taller than me. <laughs> let's see if he doesn't spook around me and just kicks me. <laughs> Doubt it. Oh, good. Oh. He's not really worried about this. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, there's no plant in it besides a bunch of weeds. This is scaring him somehow. <laughs> Always put your hand on their back so they know you're behind them. You do not want to get kicked. <laughs> He 
He's so fuzzy still, isn't he? Yeah. He hasn't. I mean, he's shedding, but he's not shedding that bad. You would think he'd be losing a lot of his winter coat by now. Warm. Good boy, John. He's cute. He's a cutie. I told his his mom, his owner, he's very lucky to have him. He's a good horse. He like doesn't try to attack you or be aggressive. He's mellow when he's confident and calm. And he's just trying to, you know, understand what you want him to do. He's a willing partner. This is what I call a willing partner, Sam. This is a, the horse I would let you have. It'd buck me off right now. They'll put it up in the barrel or? Um, yeah, put it up on the barrel. I'm gonna warm him up. Okay guys, so here we are with Judd. I have him on the bit. So after working with the Bozal for a few weeks, we're able to bend at the pole. As you can see, we just give the seesaw pressure. Good. Testing his one rain stop. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, 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 bum. That's what I like about these long cheek piece bits. When you're doing your flexing, it doesn't go through the mouth. I've seen some bits go through the horse's mouth. You're like, uh. No, thank you. That's not supposed to happen. <laughs> okay, so he's feeling quite soft. He definitely is a lot softer on this side than the other side. Over here, I still have to apply a little pressure. Trying my best not to shake. Bum, bum, bum. Bum, bum, bum. All right, good. And then here we go. We're gonna walk on with a bend at the pole. I'm going to seesaw my reins and you're going to see him bend at the pole. Okay, no bend. Squeeze your legs in. There we go. That's for forward. This is why your tie downs, they don't hold the horse's head naturally down, but your hands do because you're controlling. You're controlling everything. And obviously you're releasing the pressure when that horse gives in. So right there we release pressure. I know what I can do. Oh boy.
This is tiring. Some first person action of the jacket, I guess. Like near him. Yeah. See guys, this is why you gotta really sit deep in your seat. Hunker in. That's why I haven't fallen off, because I'm glued. My butt is glued. <laughs> if you weren't ready, if that would have happened to one of you, I guarantee you would have fallen if you weren't ready, keeping your heels down, toes up. It would suck to fall down there. I'm gonna go with the turn. <laughs>
touching you. Oh no, it's touching me. <laughs> <laughs> That's what he's saying. Ah, get it away. <laughs> Look at how he's turned away from it. <laughs> I hate when people do that. Oh my god. <laughs> like when they do it to me. Ugh. Well, you do it on one side, you must do it on the other side. Because if I just keep doing it on this side, and then one day I decide to throw it all over here, he's totally gonna, gonna be spooked because he's never experienced this side. It's weird, huh? You're weird. That's why you say, well, you do to one side, you must do it to the other side. Because they react differently. Either side. I get in front of him. It's weird how he doesn't like it in front of him, but to the side, he's okay. Kill the tarp. <laughs>